We're now in the semifinals. And the bouts are just really, really intense. Impressive fights from all of our fighters. We just want to showcase the greatness of our Filipino fighters in Muay Thai. As young as uh, 11 years old, all the way to the seniors. And here we go. These guys are bigger now, 54 kilograms, 18 to 40 years old. Usually, sa so magaritong weight, uh, mas malalakas at mas uh, yung mga sipa at suntok. Okay? You see now, there you go. Gipulao, throwing deep kick, hitting uh, Alabata at the end of his kick. These guys are fighting from the distance now from the side elbows. Knees. As you can see from this fight, from earlier fight, may body protection. So for the seniors, wala na pong body protector. But still has the elbow and the shin guard. And head the, the headgear. Okay. For this fight, it's three rounds of three minutes each. All legal Muay Thai techniques permitted. Oh, that was a good turning kick by Alibala. There you go. That was a strong, strong uh, head control by Kupulao, but both of them fell down. Kupulao loves throwing that uh, left hook of his. Plunging hook. There you go. Alabata showing uh, tremendous knees there while in the clinch. Gipolao has the propensity of throwing punches going in. If uh, what he can do better here is uh, he's longer to throw kicks. But uh, what he's doing is doing more. He's stepping in and throwing punches and that he threw that uh, training. Uh, strong roundhouse on the thigh of uh, Gipolao by Alabata. Uh, there you go. Dito dapat nagkakapitalize si Gipolao in this range. Lalo na nasa corner si Alabata kanina. Or is that maximizing that opportunity? That was a good uh, round of spell about and uh, another uh, real house kick. A side kick from Alabata pushes uh, Gipola to the ropes. Push kick by uh, Gipola. Uh, End of the first round. Missing. That was a quick first round for both senior fighters. But, magandang gawin dun dito, dito ni Gupalao for the next two rounds. Uses range, uses distance. But Alabata is uh, showing great roundhouse kicks. And when Gupalao goes in, Alabata has strong knees on the inside. We're now in the semifinals of senior 80 to 40 years old. 54 kilograms between Iligan City, Gipolao, and Zamboanga City, Alabata. For this, we have three rounds of three minutes each. Gipolao is uh, trying to go inside. And there you go. He's still trying to go for that punch. Well, if he leads with a kick, especially with that uh, inner thigh kick, mas mapapasok ni Gipolao yan. And also, when you try to go for the kicks on the thighs, at least you can slow down the attacks of your opponent. 
another uh, heel kick by uh, Alabata. And as uh, Gipulao was uh, moving back, Alabana was able to catch him with a uh, roundhouse. Side kick, a stepping in kick by Alabata with a combination of punch, another roundhouse to the back. Kung si Gipulao gumagawa lang din ng ganyan, lalo na sa inside the uh, uh, time, ni Alabata, when you gather in points or even hurt Alabata, to at least stop him from moving in. If Gipulao wants to use his uh, punches, he should stay in the range and throw combinations. Because from this distance, he's being picked apart by Alabato or he's, he's being hit from afar. So, kailangan niya mag-step in and throw combinations. As you can see, there is a good combination of a kick punch kick by Alabata. Kipla was just uh, just standing there. He's not even moving. Uh, I want to see more of Kipla moving forward. If he wants to use more of his punches, he needs to get in. There you go. So and then more combinations. Tina played in one and two. And then from that clinching, he needs to throw more knees and elbows. Because he's letting Alabata rack up points against him. Oh, that was a nice uh, inside high kick by Alabata. That's what I was uh, saying earlier. If you plug and do that, there you go. That was a good timing already by Alabata. He's able now. He's now uh, he's gotten the distance already. That was a good punch by uh, Gipulao. So this fight, is, sometimes it's not just about having uh, speed, but also that good timing, that lateral movement. That was a good uh, round by Alabaca. Medyo uh, looking stiff si Gipulao doon, but... Uh, we still have the third round for him to catch up. <coughs> and uh, Alabata staying to uh, staying standing while in the, in the break. Chose to stay standing. Gipulao for, uh, for him to have a chance on winning. He has to move in and throw combinations. Okay? Uh, let me say, siguro, throw caution, throw caution in the wind already. Kasi, eh, pansin ko kay Gipulao, mas hilig niya ang uh, sumusuntok. And for that, to, uh, to land, he has to be in the range of punching. So he has to be in the pocket. And while he's trying to step in, Alabata is kicking him right like, like that one. There you go, but he was able to land that... Uh, Job also. There you go. Alabata is now doing left and right kicks while uh, Lipalao is going in. So, we'll see what Lipalao has to really take chances here and go in. Was, uh, this last round to catch up and uh, he, he has to take the chance to grab the opportunity to just keep on attacking just keep on attacking mawa sa kanya mag-throw na siya na kanyang combination 1 and 2 1 and 2 1 and 2 kaysa naghihintay siya nagtutrow lang ng uh, just doing feints kailangan niya mag kasi naunahan siya parati ni Alabata dito Medyo nag-aabang siya dito. Gusto niya mag-counter punching but uh, at this point, 
He needs to take over the fight. See, Alabata is uh, finishing his uh, punch combination with kicks also. And uh, for you viewers out there, mas binibigyan ng importance is there's more impact and there's more force when you land the kick. There you go, see? He's picking apart uh, Gipolao from uh, the distance. Gipolao has to throw his uh, left and his jab. He wants to uh, at least take over this fight. There you go. And, and this fight, just to go. He's trying to trip uh, Alabata. There you go. And Alabata is just really making use of that uh, inside the uh, tight kick and that uh, turning kick also landing on the bread basket of Dipolao. There you go. Another one on the bread basket of Dipolao. And ito pinapakita ni Alabata all the way from Zamboanga. Sabi niya siguro I'll make uh, the most out of my travel going here to uh, Metro Manila. So far, maganda pin pinapakita niya Alabata but uh, Dipolao is still in the fight. And that's it for the third uh, final round. It goes to the judge's decision. And there's the fight. Semi-finals fight. Seniors, 18 to 40 years old, 54 kilograms. From Iligan City, in the blue corner, John Maki Dipolao. And from Zumbuanga City, in the red corner, Noel Alabata. Bring it back 153. Winner of points from the red corner, Zamboanga City. The winner from Zamboanga, Noel Alabata. Because there you go. He was picking apart Alabata with his kicks. Kailangan kasi dito sa Muay Thai. Makuha mo yung distance with the kicks. Ngayon, kung nakuha yung kicks, pasok ka para mapasok mo yung kicks. His opponent from the blue corner, Jan Den Aldana Jr., Royal Station of the Philippines National Training Pool. We'll be having a 15 minutes break after this talk. And in this fight, Semi-finals for Junior.